Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm back with a makeup tutorial after so so long and this is the makeup I did on my Walima. So this video is really really special for me. And from now I'll try to be constant with my makeup tutorial. So without any further ado, let's just quickly jump into this video. I hope you guys enjoyed my Walima look. So let's start. So guys, for priming up my eyelids, I'm taking Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and I'm going to put that on my lids and blend it with the help of a Kabuki brush. palette from beautify by amna and taking the shade translucent to set my eyelids with it for eyes i've taken wet and wild and huda beauty mercury retrograde palette i'm taking the lightest shade out of this palette and putting it on my crease focusing the shadows on the outer v and then blending it on the eyes now i'm taking the darker shade from the same palette and with the help of a fluffy brush i'm going to blend it in circular motion now taking this big fluffy brush and I'm blending both the eyeshadows together to make sure that there is no harsh lines I've taken this kajal pencil by Rivage and I'm gonna put it on my upper lash line now I've taken the small fluffy brush and I'm smudging the kajal on both the eyes brush I'm putting the white shadow on the inner corners of my eyes to make my eyes look a little open now adding the black shadow gradually to give it a smoky look now I'm mixing this really gorgeous rose gold and the golden shade together and I'm gonna put it on my lids and as you guys can see this is looking stunning and it has turned out really beautiful in the pictures also so I really love this palette so I put the lashes on off camera now I'm filling in my brows and making the brows makes a huge difference in makeup so yeah doing that in my waterline and I'm gonna smudge it with the help of a smudging brush and I'm gonna put the same shadows which I have put on my upper eyes and blend everything in now I'm putting moisturizer on my face and I'm gonna massage it through my face and neck really nicely so that my base sits really well and after that i'm gonna color correct my uh, dark circles and wherever i have acne scars or any spots with the help of a la girl pro coverage concealer in the shade pure beige and i'm gonna blend it in with the help of a buffing brush Maybelline Fit Me Super Staple Coverage Foundation and I'm just dotting it all over my face and neck. Start blending the foundation with the help of my fingers because your fingers have warmth in it and it blends your foundations really well and then I'm gonna use a buffing brush to blend the further foundation in and then I'm gonna use the beauty blender to make sure that there's no harsh lines. Then I took the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and I have just put it in the higher points of my face to highlight my face and then I'll blend it with magic like this for contouring I've taken glam girl contour wheel and I'm gonna contour my face and I'll blend that in also again taking this palette from beautify by Amna to set my face really really well then I'm gonna take top face contour duo to give my face a little dimension to it and then I'm gonna take the blush from Beautify by Amna, it's Victorian Ritual Blush Palette and I'm gonna put blush on the higher points of my face to make my face look a little lifted. Now taking my all-time favorite Wet n Wild highlighter in the shade Precious Petals and I'm highlighting my higher points of the face. 
it gives really nice and luminous finish to your face it's not one of those chunky highlighters so i really love this now i'm gonna take these two lipsticks maybelline and top face and i'm gonna put the darker shade on the outer part of my lip and the lighter shade in the inner part of my lip and then i'll mix the both shades to finish the look so guys this is the final look i'm just quickly gonna set my hairs and uh, you know get complete ready and then i'll be back with my final look all right guys so this is my final look i hope you guys liked it and if you guys did please don't forget to give this video a big fat thumbs up also do subscribe to my channel if you haven't and i will catch you guys in my brand new one till then bye